Previously on Barefoot Sailing Adventures. Spinnakers and boobies. <laughs> a topless girl on the sailboat really doesn't get much better than this. Sailing is such an amazing experience. Absolutely love sailing. We're moving, yeah. We're moving pretty good now. Wind's starting to kick up just a little bit. We're gonna jibe this asymmetrical spinnaker. Untie this to depower the sail. Maintain control of the sail down to here. Then take this back. I think that was just as smooth as could have been. Ha <laughs> ha! All right, that was a pretty quick little single-handed. Look, we've picked up a lot of speed here. The Charlotte Harbor towards the Gulf of Mexico. Exciting and fun is the name of the game. Woo! Highly successful jive. Well, I think I did a good job of navigating us down through here. Woo! We're cruising. Wind picked up a little bit. Look at how the this shadow. Yeah. It's cool looking, isn't it? Is yeah. Wow, look at this, guys. We just picked up we a bunch of speed. Over. You could hear it just pick up. Listen to this. Just like that. Now it's spirited fun. Ooh, buddy. And just that quick. Here we go. Now we're going. Maybe you can just put it on top because this could be good YouTube material. Do hickeys. Do hickeys. <laughs> Invented these things. We're having such an amazing sale right here. Things just got interesting. Things just got interesting. We're healed over pretty good. We are. And we are just ripping. Frozen. Out into the Charlotte Harbor. And it's such a beautiful look at this. A lot of power in that sail. There's a bit of wind right here. Do you have a pontoon that is anchored ahead? I see that. I think they're just drifting. We cruise right by them. It makes my heart race every time we get killed over like this though. I ain't gonna lie. Not from fear or anything, but just from like adrenaline. It gets you on your toes. Gets you up on your toes because you realize you're in a sailboat and you have this sail up here that is so sensitive to wind. It picks up every bit of it. We could go over. <laughs> it feels that way. It would take a lot. It would take a lot, but it feels that way. You realize that, like, oh man. It could just keep going if it really wanted to. <laughs> hey, you can't mess with Mother Nature now. Yeah, Mother Nature will win every time. If she wants to blow you over, she will blow you over. <laughs> That's it. That's so true. Super exciting. Some good sailing. We, we're making headway now. We were actually going to go back for dinner, but... <laughs> I think Mother Nature's pushing us out, out to the Gulf. Freaking awesome! This is cool. <laughs> Woo! People that haven't been sailing before, y'all are missing out. Get cool. out there, try it out. Not only in a better position to be able to let off that sail. Yeah. It's best to be ready. Yeah. Now I feel like I have a little more control. I've got. That's too far up into the wind. There you we can go. just feel this thing, just want to take this thing. But right now I've got a hand. Hand ready. Right here. But as you can see, I've got a couple turns on it. Yes. So I don't have to really hold it. Yep. But if I just unhook that, it'll begin to go out. And then it'll just start luffing. And we can take it. It would luff and then we can take it down. This is where it's at. To feel nature's power. Really get in touch with the wind and to have it in your hands. Like a kite pulls. She's pulling. She's pulling. Could just keep sailing. Go out to Boca Grande. Hit that first. I don't think so. I think we're going to spin around. We're going to put this down and we're going to go back to where we said we were going to go. Aww. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to put this sail down. So I'm going to need you to get on the wheel. Plan of attack is just get ready with the halyard. Nothing to it. Nose up into the wind to depower the sail and get control of it back here. And then we'll have to get on that halyard over here. And we'll have to just drop it in place. Uh, no, it needs to be reversed. I just dropped it just a little bit. Ooh, just let go here. You want me to put the motor down or yeah. get ready? Or... So now we've just depowered that sail as you can see. And now if Ashley will just drop that halyard. Hang on. Uh-oh, we're in trouble now. <laughs> we just dunked it. That's okay, it'll make it easier to handle. Once you get it wet, 
certainly makes it a little safer. I think I learned that just now. Teamwork, all right. Made a couple mistakes there. I didn't have control of that line as best as I could have. Unfortunately, it means you've got to dry it out. It does. So I'm gonna leave it out. I'm just gonna control this halyard so we don't lose it. Cool, now you, if you wanna put up the rudders and the keel, we could try to sail back upwind. Gentlemen, never sail upwind. We'll let the scoundrels beat into the wind. This definitely needs to be dried out. Okay, just trying to dry this sail out. So that's up, got these up? Yep. Wow, you don't even need me. <laughs> you can do this for yourself. Great job. Let's switch spots. Yep. Powers down, slightly up. That was fun. Yes, that was spirited there. It yeah, the was. We got a little sailing. Yes. That was oh, cool. Fun. Heck yeah. This thing will be dry in no time, look. Look at that thing over there. What's there the go. move? Looks okay to me. I do have it secured by the head. Let's see. Just pull it towards it. This part is under, and that part is what's wet, and it's attached. What do you think? Not bad, huh? Looks like it's gonna work. Once it's thoroughly dry, we'll put it away. Let's see if she's dry. I think it's working. All right, I think it's dry. Yep. We're just gonna put this sail away real quick. All right, I think we did it. Now we've got both lines out drying. The boat is under control and everything's good. Ashley's at the helm. Good thing I've got Ashley, because if I didn't have you, I wouldn't have anything. All right, we're motoring back into Fisherman's Village. Fisherman's Village. Go have some dinner. You want me to hit this, this cam these cameras? Yes, please. Doc here at the Fisherman's Village. We have Ashley on the bow, it appears. As I gaze up there, there is a large crowd. You see the crowd up there, Ashley? Oh, yeah. Front row parking. This is part of the fun for me. I enjoy a bit of an audience. You definitely do. I love an <laughs> audience, you know? And that always makes it a little more crucial that you don't mess this up. So I'm gonna try to put us near steps. Sounds good. So we can step off, walk up to that bar, start ordering drinks. Uh, how about a margarita? Looking good, Ash. Which side of the steps? The very end or farther in? Yeah, I'm gonna be inside, like. Okay, nice, very nice. Right? Tell you what we're gonna do is slide you up to the next one. That's where she's gonna live right there. Okay. Nicely done. Yeah, that'll, that's the way to do it. All right, let's get a couple fenders on this thing just so people aren't alarmed. Let's put some fenders on this thing. All right, here we go. Good job, Ashley. Well done. Awesome, we made it. Yeah. Sweet. Do the same thing here. I don't know if that's gonna make it through dinner or not, but at least we tried. So we got a big crowd here tonight. Always more exciting when you have a crowd. Click right here to visit us on Patreon, folks. You're not gonna wanna miss all the awesome content that you're gonna find over there. We appreciate all you guys for watching. We're sailing Tampa Bay to Key West.